you are listening to the voice of the gospel a proclamation of the holy scripture by wisdom ministries march 1st monday let's begin this month with the blessings of god a reading from the holy gospel according to saint luke chapter 6 verses 36 to 38 be merciful just as your father is merciful do not judge and you will not be judged do not condemn and you will not be condemned forgive and you will be forgiven give and it will be given to you good measure pressed down shaken together running over will be put into your lap for the measure you give will be the measure you get back the gospel of the lord praise you lord jesus christ dear friends in a mental hospital an insistent reporter asked the doctor in charge how they would know him no if a person is normal already the doctor said we do the bathtub test that is we will fill the bathtub with water and give the patient a spoon a cup and a bucket and ask him to empty the bathtub a normal person would uh, of course use the bucket right as the reporter no a normal person would just pull the drain plug would you want a room or a ward was the doctor's reply in today's gospel jesus advises us the to be compassionate non judgmental non condemning forgiving the faults we see and generous in our assessment of others 365 days to the lord a liturgical biblical diary of the society of st paul said also that in some situations in life we cannot escape the obligation to make judgments even on the moral character of others clearly evil should be condemned jesus himself does so jesus teaching wants however against a spirit the definitive judgment of god who alone sees the heart by contrast with the god's judgment we must recognize our judging as tentative partial and inadequate be compassionate jesus commands us to be compassionate be to be merciful this means more than intimation it means that god's attitudes must become ours his way of dealing with us must come naturally to us when we deal with others this is not an option too but a christian obligation why does he command us it is because there was there are so many souls who are in need of jesus love mercy and as his disciples we are called to be living witness of his mercy and love yes be forgiving of the fault of others forgiveness is a serious matter to god he said that if we don't forgive others then we will not be able to experience god's love and forgiveness in our lives in fact the apostle paul said that when we refuse to forgive we actually end up giving satan a foothold in our lives yes be non judgmental and non condemning is jesus trying to scare us yes he is somebody said that jesus wants us to point out the gravity of judging and condemning others and how this can th- threaten our own salvation jesus invites us not to take the path of pride and ego because these only lead us to condemnation but to take the path of virtue who wants to be condemned what sinner does not want experience god's forgiveness this is our calling to pardon and forgive jesus said love one another as i have loved you amen may god bless us <laughs>